Musculoskeletal ultrasound is a way to image patients non-invasively with sound waves. Any patient can have a musculoskeletal ultrasound. Patients who have been ineligible for MRI because they have pacemakers or they have certain kinds of metallic implants in their body or they're claustrophobic or perhaps even too large um, to be compatible with an MRI, uh, can have an ultrasound. And so it's particularly good to look at soft tissue structures, particularly peripherally like rotator cuff or uh, tendons and ligaments in the hands and the fingers, uh, foot and ankle. And um, it's really good to look at patients who are post-operative who maybe have metal implants in and around the knee or the shoulder who might have too much artifact caused by those implants for CT and MRI. Patients really find it quite comfortable to tolerate because they can just sit down and have the examination. They don't need to lie particularly still for it. Uh, they don't need to hold their breath and um, you know it's, it's a very comfortable experience for them. Ultrasound should not be used to look at patients who have bone tumors because the beam cannot penetrate the bone um, to uh, the degree that MRI can or CT can. And in addition, uh, ultrasound is not the first line to look for patients with internal derangement of the knee. For instance, patients with cruciate ligament tears in the knee and ultrasound should not be used to look at labral tears in the shoulder or in the hip. MRI is really going to be the first line for that. But in older patients, for instance, who have a focused complaint, let's say of the biceps tendon or of the rotator cuff, where clinically the doctor really suspects that that is the condition, ultrasound would be a very useful first line test for that. It's, it's a very important tool for um, diagnosis because it's um, quick to do, it's relatively easy to do, and it's very cost effective. And it also provides uh, a very nice way for the doctor to interact with the patient. The patient finds out immediately what's going on with them and they get direct feedback from the doctor. Another great thing about ultrasound is that you can do dynamic imaging. So you can image exactly where the patient hurts, you can bring them through the range of motion that recreates the pain, and you can provide therapy on the spot. So you can you know, inject medication into a tendon sheath or bursa where you find the problem and provide immediate relief. So ultrasound can you know, directly guide the intervention and the patient walks away extremely happy.